Skuma wiki or collard is one of the vegetables you can grow easily or without um, a lot of skills to do that. Uh, but there are some things you need to, to look at or there are some things you need to be familiar with for you to, to be able to grow it. One of them is pest control. Uh, the second is uh, nutrition and the third one is uh, disease control and in this lesson uh, we want to discuss about the disease control uh, the disease that attacks these young seedlings at this stage uh, once you planted young seedlings remember we water our, our farm we plant and we keep watering them um, uh, when we water them during the day and at night the, 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 the soil is still wet and cold or you're in an area where it's cold, in most cases there is a likelihood of attack of, to be attacked by a, a fungal disease and this fungal disease is dumping off. Dumping off attacks these young siblings as small as they are. And dumping off is brought in by the cold condition, cold and humid condition. When you water and it's cold, especially at night, when uh, it's cold and uh, it's very humid, that when dumping off uh, attacks the young siblings. I've not experienced um, an attack of dumping off, but I would like to showcase or to show you where, where it attacks and how it looks like. You see, for example, this young stem here, it's not yet attacked, but uh, it's just for, for demonstration. Uh, the area where it touches the soil, you find that the stem at that point, it's rotting. It's rotting, it is, it, it's rotting around the stem, or it's rotting in one area of the stem. Uh, it's, the color of rotting is... Uh, is brown in color it's brown in color so um, you'll be able to see it clearly and sometimes when you bed it uh, it end up breaking or it end up uh, now falling down because of of the rotting at the base of the stem that what we call dumping off um, it kills young seedlings both in, in the nursery and and in the main field in my case when I do, when I plant uh, skuma wiki or when I plant collard, I usually come and drench them using um, a product with mancozeb and metalaxel. That is what I usually drench them with so that I can be able to fight or to stop the dumping off from attacking my young seedlings. If you are able to control dumping off, off at this stage, it won't appear again. When they grow, they they are not going to be attacked by dumping off. So that is our first lesson about the disease control. That's what you need to control at this stage until we meet uh, in our next episode or in our next training about the diseases. If this is your first time you're watching me or you're new uh, in this YouTube channel, don't forget to subscribe so that we can continue learning together. Bye.